A gunman dressed in black killed at least four people in a string of shootings in the U.S. state of California yesterday before he was shot dead by the police. The rampage left five others wounded. There's a spot at the corner, Robbie. Police say the carnage began inside a home where the gunman shot two people dead before torching the house. Yes. The victims are reportedly the gunman's father and brother. As the house burst into flames, the gunman shot and wounded a woman in a car and then carjacked another woman. As he made his way towards Santa Monica College, he sprayed bullets everywhere. And the shooter was just all up in black and uh, he looked like a cop. The suspect was armed with a rifle and a handgun and wore an ammunition belt and bulletproof jacket. He opened fire on a city bus, a police car, and other vehicles, as well as bystanders and pedestrians. The suspect headed toward the library, uh, shot a woman on the campus just before entering the library. Inside the library, gunshots rang out, bringing sheer terror to students studying for final exams. One witness couldn't stop shaking after seeing one woman get shot in the head with students running for their lives or ducking for cover. We heard a loud bang, what sounded like a shotgun or a small bomb, and then a few repetitive gunshots after that. And we opened the door and we heard bang, 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 and then that's when we just figured we're just going to stay inside the room where we know um, we're safe. It was an exchange of gunfire with police that stopped the bloodshed. The officers came in and directly engaged the suspect and he was shot and killed on the scene. The gunman has yet to be identified. Police are combing the various crime scenes to determine his motive. The shooting rampage broke out just a few kilometers from where President Barack Obama was speaking at a fundraiser. But Secret Service later confirmed Obama left safely for a summit with President Xi Jinping.